Hello everyone, I am Playgamer3 and welcome to Let's Play Broken Helix Fitz Storyline Part 2. Level 5. game. I don't know why Jake can't jump more than two feet. Oh man, nothing is ever easy. Okay, so this is similar to the um, restory line. You have to well, I'm feeling kind of invincible. Go through the air ducts to um, get to Fitz's hideout. Level four. Okay, let's get the map. Dark is not one of my favorite colors. Yeah, this part always reminds me of aliens, um, where the aliens are in the air ducts. Yeah, radical. Okay, I'm almost out of here. Okay, so we need needing this map anymore. Oh man, you call this a game design? <laughs> Usually three aliens in here. Oh yeah, baby. Okay, there's a third one. Guess he was hiding. Groovy. Groovy. Evil Dead. Groovy. Dolphin dive. Okay, so this is gonna get messy. Another jihad scientist. Come on, you wanna blow me up? Catch me. <laughs> Guess he gave up. Okay, so I gotta go get Sarah so she can. Interview Reese, I mean Fitz. Access granted. What are you still doing here? Oh, I just thought we could talk for a while. <laughs> Boy, why she give me the cold shoulder? I mean, I did save her life. Hey, buddy, I need to see Fitz. Yeah, to kill him. No, I have someone he wants to see. Who? What do you mean, who? Her, a reporter. It's Sarah Compton. We met earlier. Sorry, he's not interested. What do you mean not interested? Open the door. But but you told me. Do it. You heard the man open the door. Come on. Where is he? 
just inside those doors. He, he's really lost it. Oh, yeah, tell me something I don't know. You're Jake Burton, aren't you? Yeah. Reese is expecting you. He, he told me to tell you. Welcome to my humble abode. Well, I pity you. You can't think for yourself, so you follow an idiot. I, I just do as Fitz says. Oh, I do as Fitz says. <laughs> I like that Ooh. voice. Are you with Fitz? Mm, maybe. Well, I have something he wants. Go away, you silly Englishman. Look, I have to get through. Fitz is expecting me. I don't want any trouble. <laughs> I never understood this character. I mean, I don't think Jake's an Englishman. Yeah, I gotta push the button. They're too lazy to do it. Level four. Okay, that's a glitch. Fits. I gotta go get some power ups. So, what can you tell me about Fitz? He cracked after we showed him a tape of an experiment he's working on. Is that a fly or a bee? Ooh, dig it, man, dig it. Helps boo-boos heal real fast. Only in video games, Jake. Access granted. It's oh, I'm feeling line. kind of invincible. Take it you two connected the amplifier. Yes, we're ready to roll. Be sure to get my good side. I'm inside the notorious base called Area 51, standing with the terrorist responsible for the bomb scare. Hello, America. I have something I want to show you. What you just witnessed is an injustice to mankind. That thing you saw attack that scientist was at one time a human. Project Broken Helix has gone too far. It started out as an attempt to find anecdotes for germ warfare and has turned into a bioweapons experiment. The military wants to create an army of powerful mutant warriors and is using human test subjects to perfect them. Why? For war, of course. Well, there you have it. After years of wondering why the government wouldn't even acknowledge the existence of Area 51, we find out why. Sarah Compton, reporting for Channel 28 News. Cut. It's a wrap. I could use a man like you. Interested? Well, that depends. Hear me out. The Marines, led by Black Dawn, are headed this way. I need your help to stop their progress. Uh -huh. You are a pawn in your government's game. All right, I'll do it. Go to the robot command center located on this level in the assembly area and use the warbots to stop the marines. Here's the key to the robot command center. Let's rock and roll. Okay, I gotta get Fitz and company out of here because... Level three is secure. Exterminate. Electrical fields operative. Time to microwave the freaks. Move out, grunts. Yeah, Black Dawn is about to attack the place, so... Okay, they're safe in here, so... Level 5. Okay, so what I have to do is... Go get a war bot... So I can distract um, Black Dawn... So Fitz and company can escape. Access granted. So the 
Warbot is in here. Use the key Fitz gave me. Access granted. Okay, there's the Warbot. Warbot activated. It should be coming through that door. <laughs> They're taking their time. I mean, it's not like, you know, you got murderous Marines out to kill you. Okay, so Black Don should be um, coming through that door in a couple minutes, so have to use this war bot to distract them. Stay frosted, people. Get it, yeah, yeah. You can't kill Black Don because you have force fields around him, so just gotta distract him, so give Reese enough time to escape. Get out of here so Black Dawn won't kill me. Oh, that was close. Almost died. I gotta hurry up and get out of Access here. Access granted. Access granted. Okay, so Fitz and company should have escaped by now. Level four. Level five. Okay, there they are, so all three of them made it out. Yeah, that's the mole. That's the guy that's gonna drive Fitz out of Area 51. Yada, yada, yada. I don't know why I can't talk to him. Yeah, radical. Okay, so let's see what Fitz wants next. Now what? I have a surprise. I hate surprises. I have C4 explosives. Where do you get this stuff? Military leftovers. Listen, I need you to take one of the explosives and go level to level 10. Yeah? Then what? There is a circuit panel located nearby. Plant the explosive near the panel and hook it up. Why level 10? When it explodes, a reactor located nearby will blow up the force field surrounding the base. Can't believe I'm working for this wacko. What? Oh, I said uh, working for you is really wacky. <laughs> We don't have much time, Burton. If you're not going to help, then get lost! <laughs> Boy, that guy's uptight. I don't know if I like working for this guy. He does seem a little unstable. Yeah, a little. I think he can get us out of this mess. Let's do what he says. I hope you're right. You don't always have to be in charge. I know, I know. It just feels right. Well, I hope this interview was worth it. The best of my career. Thanks for helping me out, Jake. No problem. See you around. Yeah, see ya. Yeah, see ya. <laughs> okay, so I gotta go down to level 10 and blow up the reactor so to get rid of his force field so Fitz can make his I escape. I've got a bad feeling about this. Frickin' Frick, check it out. <laughs> Us? Yeah, you got a problem with that? <laughs> can you say guinea pig, man? <laughs> Sound like Shaggy back there. Well then, I guess we'll need more grunts, huh? There's a garrison of marines on level 8. Why are we here then? They're trapped, but we can free them. How many are there? A small army of about 250 men. Party time! 
you're gonna be meeting those 250 men at the end of the game. Level eight. Boo boos heal real fast. More aliens. Oh, alien hybrids. Ooh, dig it, man, dig it. Level 10. Okay, level 10. So, I gotta get to the generator, use the C4, blow it up, so the force field can be deactivated and we can make our escape. Who wants some? <laughs> Missed him. Hey, get off my head. I hate these spider creatures. Yeah, I always hated this um, area. There's too many enemies here, and if you kill them, just respawn a couple of minutes, so well, that was you just, fun. You just waste your ammo trying to kill them. There's no place like home, there's no place like home. Groovy. Oh, I hate the jumping in this game. See more enemies just respawn out of nowhere. Okay, so it's the, the end of part three. I mean, no, the end of part two. I'll see you guys in part three, the final.